Margie. Welcome to On the Road with RTR. In this episode, we take a short tour of RTR. Find out what people do at break time. Sit down with the president of RTR and ask the question, what's your favorite thing about RTR? So join us for On the Road with RTR. My name is Dave. We are taking a tour today from RTR. Hi, my name is David Ricci. I'm the coordinator of training here at Road to Responsibility. And um, some of the things that I do are I teach human rights and dignity classes where we discuss what our rights and responsibilities are as people. And um, it's wonderful. Um, I think the best part of my job is that um, it's a very supportive place to work. Um, I feel that we're all encouraging each other every day and this is the very first job that I've had and I'm 50 years old so I've had a lot of jobs. This is the very first job that I've had that I truly love to come to work every single day because I feel that the work that we do here is just so good. We just, we help each other and um, so it's wonderful to work at Road to Responsibility. Hi, my name is Deborah Stanley and I am the VP of Marketing and Sales at Road to Responsibility. I've been here for 19 years and I find that this place is a fun and challenging place to work. Uh, I, my job is to provide individuals with disability jobs not only in the community but in five workshops in Braintree, Marshfield, two in Marshfield. Uh, Plymouth and Taunton and uh, I find that we are a very collegial group we work together we have a common goal we try to make every day buddy's day in work services meaningful fun I like to provide a diverse amount of work for everybody in the workshops and I feel that I can actually call this place my home I love the people that work here, the staff, the individuals, we all work as a team. And I would highly recommend anybody that's looking for a job to come to Road to Responsibility and fill out an application as we always have openings for people that are dedicated and motivated to work with people. So thank you. Matt. I'm the IT director here at RTR. Um, I oversee all of our computer systems at um, our corporate office and all of our outside locations. And um, I like working at RTR because I get to do something different every day. Tune 
Tarrow Time, staff facility, employment based trainings, teach critical aspects such as interview techniques, resume writing, and being a team player. In addition to employment based training, clients also engage in the active physical activities using systems such as Nintendo Wii. Welcome to our Novo World RTR. Um, I hear with Chris Wright, the, um, the president of our um, Voter Responsibility. Um, today's question is for you, um, um, how long have you been with RTR? Well, Joe, th first, thanks for having me on today. It's You're great welcome. seeing you again. Nice to see and you uh, I've been with RTR in, in my position now for just about four years. In September, it'll be four years. But, but you know, I've actually been involved with RTR since the very beginning. I was the first executive director of RTR back in 1988, and, uh, and then I left after I got my doctorate, but I always stayed involved, <coughs> uh, and then I came back four years ago as the president. Well, that, how you like it? I love my job. <laughs> I love RTR. Yeah, um, how does the, the second, how did um, RTR get started? Well, RTR got started actually back in 1988, and it was designed to be just a little recreation program, believe it or not. And then another company in this area decided that they didn't want to do uh, employment or residential services anymore. And so Road to Responsibility uh, was lucky enough to have the state award those contracts from that other company to us. And so we grew very fast. Uh, mm -hmm. Overnight, we, we went from uh, you know a very tiny company to about a $7 million a year company. And now, we're over $23 million a year. Wow. That, that's, that's really good. <laughs> uh, what, what do you see your role in RTR? Well, I, as you said, I'm the president of RTR. And so, as the president, I see my role as being uh, the public face of RTR so that people people have someone that they can relate to and uh, understand but also probably the biggest part of my job is to provide leadership for the company and to uh, guide it in a good direction uh, so that we can grow and thrive for years to come. Okay. Is, is, is that about is that it? Or is it <laughs> yeah, that's, that's about it. Okay. Um, you don't want to ask me to go on because I'll talk <laughs> all day. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. We, we, we got time. The, uh, uh, is as far as uh, what do you want me to say more about that? Um, could could, it, you, could you tell me about um, could you tell me a little more about the role? Okay. The uh, a lot of what I do is I get get involved with people in the community as well as mm -hmm. uh, employees of RTR in designing new programs. And, uh, and that's probably the thing I like the most uh, uh, about my job uh, is the, the creativity that comes with developing new programs, mm -hmm. helping to design them, and to then help. It, it's, it's an awesome thing to see something that didn't exist before all of a sudden you're, you're putting effort into it and you watch it grow and then you you get individuals and staff involved and see see the programs that we're running actually making a difference in people's lives helping them uh, be happier and live more fulfilling lives in the community and that's that's just an awesome uh, feeling yeah and, that's awesome and as a psychologist that's that's what I uh, uh, went to school for, uh, it, it gives me a lot of pleasure to, 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 to know that what we're doing at RTR is really helping people. Oh, okay. That, that's really good. And Thank you. Welcome. Um, how many people work at RTR? We have right now about 530 employees. So we're a pretty good sized company. We're actually the biggest employer in Marshfield <coughs> and uh, uh, and we're one of the biggest companies of our kind in this part of the state. Oh, okay. Um, how, um, let's see, um, what pro projects or events the, uh, is going on in RTR? We have a lot going on right now. The, uh, probably the, 
the, the three biggest things that we have happening right now is uh, we've already started planning for our fundraiser, uh, which is happening on November 2nd this year. And believe it or not, even though November sounds like it's far away, mm -hmm. that is going to be here before you know it. And it takes a lot of planning to make yeah. that event take off. Mm -hmm. And so, uh, so we're well underway with that. Uh, the, <clears throat> the other piece, uh, the other thing we're uh, doing now is we're getting uh, very close to a groundbreaking for a new what's called a Roland class home. Mm -hmm. And that's uh, a Roland class home <clears throat> is a, uh, a residential home that's designed for people coming out of nursing homes mm -hmm. so they can uh, move and live into the com uh, live in the community yeah. and they have 24-hour uh, nursing supports in it the people that will be living there usually have lots of medical problems and so they need a very special kind of house to live in too. Everything has to be on one floor with big wide hallways and extra wide doors and special you know bathroom uh, uh, and kitchen setups and so uh, we're going to be uh, opening a, a new rolling class home in Norwell uh, sometime this year and probably in the fall, uh, I think uh, around October, maybe, uh, maybe right around the time of our fundraiser, mm -hmm. uh, uh, that should be opening. <coughs> and uh, it's it's going to be on Prospect Street in Norwell, and we should be breaking ground with the construction starting. I'm hoping by uh, the middle of June. Yeah, I remember the fundraiser last year, <laughs> but I, yep. I, I but I went with it through the video. Mm -hmm. oh, yes, you did. You yeah. did an awesome job with that video. Thank you. Yep, that was very cool. Yeah, People like I, seeing that. Yeah, I appreciate you having me come to, to the conference <laughs> in last year. Well, and, and hopefully you and a bunch of other people will be coming this year, too. Yeah, thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, okay, what's the goals that you have stuff right now? Oh, for, for RTR? Yeah. The, we have, we have a, a, a lot of goals, but the, to sort of sum it all up, um, mm -hmm. uh, first, it's not just me. While, while, I, uh, while I provide leadership for the whole company, it's really a team effort. It's everybody working together. So it's never just me or our board of directors or mm -hmm. uh, any single person saying what we're doing and where we're going, but it's all of us coming together and uh, deciding, and we do, uh, what's called strategic planning, uh, <clears throat> where we meet as a big group, and we also uh, uh, <clears throat> and we also uh, poll and talk to a lot of other people that we work with, and uh, or folks that we serve, or family members, people in the community, uh, to help generate our goals. And the the easy answer to the, the question is I want Road to Responsibility to be the very best human service organization in Massachusetts. Mm -hmm. I want people when they hear RTR or see our logo, I mm -hmm. want them to think that is where I would like to get services if I needed them or a family member needed them. And I want them to know that uh, that RTR stands for integrity and care and respect for the people that we serve. Okay. Uh, what, okay, the next question is, what is your favorite part of the job? Hmm. My, uh, I have a, I've got a few favorite parts of my job, <laughs> but, but easily the, the, my, my very favorite part is uh, getting out and uh, being with the people that we serve. Mm -hmm. I, I love the folks that we serve, and, uh, uh, and. Right along that is getting a chance to talk to the employees of RTR. Uh, that uh, <clears throat> that it it makes me feel very proud as well as uh, inspired when I see uh, people working hard to improve their own lives and uh, and for our staff uh, seeing how much care they really put into uh, delivering the services that we provide. It's um, okay. It's, it's really, it's something that every time I go into one of our work programs or one of our group homes <coughs> or uh, into one of our rehabilitation programs, it, it makes me joyous 
because I'm, I'm seeing people doing things that um, doing things and working together in, in ways that are really meaningful and, and helping people helping people live better lives. We really are making lives better for the people we serve. Okay, that's really good. Um, the, na the last question, what, what do you see yourself in the next five years? Oh, in five years? <laughs> Jeez, Joe, I don't know. Uh, uh, tough interview question. The, um, <clears throat> well, hopefully I'll still be the president of Road to Responsibility. I'm mm -hmm. not planning on going anywhere. Uh, I'm, I hope that I'm uh, still leading uh, RTR and uh, that we're all, that we're growing uh, uh, over the next five years and that we'll be uh, doing even bigger and better things than we are today. Uh, I see us as getting better uh, uh, really and truly every every day, every year that goes by I think we get a little bit better at what we're doing uh, and how we do it and uh, and so in five years I figure I'll be the, the leader of the, the very best human service organization in the state. Okay. And uh, in between the amazing staff that we have and the uh, and the, the the really courageous individuals that are in our programs who who work harder every day than most people would ever realize to to meet their individual goals, uh, I think we'll get there. Okay. Thank. You. Thank you for joining On the Road with RTR. All right. Join us next time. Thank Thanks, you, Joe. It's great talking to you. The question of the week is, what is your favorite thing about RTR? My name is Brenda. I live in, I work at RTR, well, responsibility. I look at all the staff and um, all the client, clients. I'm with Matt and uh, like uh, RTR, uh, come to work RTR, and um, I make some, make some uh, money, and I'm uh, pulling on the shirts, t-shirts. Hi, my name is Bonnie, and I work for RTR, and I like to pull the t-shirts. Yeah. Hi, my name is Jody, and I go work for RTR, because I come here and see all my friends, and making money. Hi, my name is Amanda. I work at Road to Responsibility in Marshfield, Mass. What I like, what I like about RTR is I like to work outside job and work independently by myself. Hi, my name is Teresa, and I like to work at outside jobs, being more independent and um, making more money. My name is Megan. My favorite thing about the about the RTR is that I. I used to do the the W Plaza at the office, <laughs> my main job. I like about it because I do more work and do more jobs and more opportunity to do more about the W Plaza. Hi, my name is Linda, and uh, I've been working at the TR with job a long time, and uh, I get um, me all my friends and. Um, I all the staff, and um, I like um, to make the money and um, see all my friends. Hey, my name is Brennan. I have a hi, I have friends. I have a staff. My name is Dave. My favorite thing at RTR is my staff and my friends. My name is Joe. Um, my favorite thing about RTR is uh, going to Curtis, um, David Queen, and um, helping the LEDs out at Mans on Wheels. My favorite thing about RTR is uh, my staff and going offside jobs. Hi, I'm Leanne. My favorite job here is going on Meals on Wheels. Thank you for joining us on the road with RTR.